Most of us think we're pretty strong-willed, that you couldn't get us to do something we didn't want to do. Well, we decided to put that notion to the test, using some pretty tough guys and some pretty strong temptation. Here's Stacy Sweet. What happens when you take one very sexy woman, add four hunky guys, and gather them all in a snazzy Florida house for a day? Well, it may not sound like family entertainment, but we've added a twist, a hypnotist, to make sure that everything that does happen wasn't supposed to happen. Hi, guys. How you doing? But first, let's meet our buxom blonde bombshell. Wrestling fans can't forget her as Sable, the former WWF Women's World Champion. She goes by her own name now, Rena Miro. Since retiring from the ring, she's made the cover of Playboy twice. She's making movies. She's modeling. She's even a comic book hero in a new series called The Tenth Muse. I cannot do, make you do anything against your morals or against your will. Because if I could, you guys would all be at my house cleaning my bathroom naked, okay? Susie Hayner is a Los Angeles-based professional hypnotist with just the right twisted sense of humor we needed for our experiment. We wanted to know if these four young men, all models, Justin, Adam, Dallas, and Jeremy, could be hypnotized into thinking Rena is, well, unattractive. As you slowly let that breath out once again, I want you to concentrate on your toes, relax your toes. Relax your jaw right now. Let your head fall forward to your chest. This too will make you feel better. Very good. You gentlemen upon awakening, all four of you gentlemen upon awakening, as soon as you wake up, you're going to see a woman sitting on my right. If she asks you to go anywhere with her or do anything, you're going to do everything you can to get out of it because you think that she's just the most disgusting woman you have ever seen in your entire life. Ready? One, two, three. Wide awake. Hi, guys. How you doing? This is a friend of mine, everyone. This is Rena. Hello. Uh -huh. Well, Rena was thinking that maybe we could go. Did you want to go get a drink or something? I would love to go out and get a drink. Would any of you guys like to take me? Um, I, I didn't drive. I don't have a car. Sorry. You don't have a car? Well, you have a car, don't you? I have a car, yes. I would be willing to drive. Um, I, pr I promised my, my uh, grandma I would help her. Is there anything I can do to talk you guys into going with me? Can we do it like some other time? I just have a lot going on today, and I have a lot of things that I've got to do. Once it appeared the guys were hypnotized, we figured there was some other mischief we could get into. Why don't you sit right here? You know for a fact that her favorite line is, what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? However, the only problem is, every single time that you open up your mouth, your tongue is now four feet long. So, um, what's a nice girl like you doing? I'm sorry. sorry. I was just going to say, what's the nice girl I could give that? So, what? <laughs> what? Hey, never, never mind. She loves a man that can just really synchronize when that's wearing goggles. <laughs> and how about this? Tell the boys that they're really thirsty, but they can't swallow. <laughs> I certainly like a man who's not afraid to drool. <laughs> <laughs> now, some of these guys didn't think that they'd even been hypnotized because they could remember everything that happened. Ms. Hayner says that's not uncommon. If you'd like to learn more about Hayner, Miro, or our shoot location, just go to our website, InsideEdition.com. On tomorrow's Deborah Duncan, she's back, the amazing hypnotist Susie Hayner. You gentlemen, upon awakening, I am the one and only Miss Britney Spears, and you are my dancers. Oh, baby, baby, how was I supposed to know? with her hypnotizing comedy tomorrow at 9 on Deborah Duncan on ABC 13. Susie Hayner was working with several of our audience members, and you are putting them under, and they are under and over right now. <laughs> they are definitely out. Yes, they are. Okay, so the idea was to go ahead and make them very relaxed and actually put them to sleep. Right, right they're in a, actually in a heightened state of concentration and relaxation. Okay, all right, so we, we can them. make them do some stuff. Oh, yeah. absolutely. Let's do some stuff. Absolutely. Okay.
All right, start. Okay, here we go. Everyone on stage, one, two, three. Wide awake, wide awake, wakey, wakey. Hi, hi, hello, hello, hi. I don't remember hypnotizing this one. <laughs> sleep and sleep. You two gentlemen, I'm touching upon awakening. From this moment on, any time throughout the evening that I ask you your name, you'll have no idea. Every single time that I ask you your name, you cannot remember, no matter how hard you try, you two cannot remember your names. One, two, three, wide awake. Hi, you guys kind of dozed off there. You guys want to meet everybody? Yeah. Okay, you know, I am really bad with names, sweetheart. I'm sorry, I forgot your name. Your name is? Mary. Mary, and you are? Jeannie. And your name is? Your name, sir. Okay, I'll come back to you. Your name is? Jean. And you are? <laughs> James, look, he can't remember his name. <laughs> Isn't that funny? It's hilarious. <laughs> Could that ever happen to you? No way. <laughs> and your name is? This is really strange. Oh, I, I have an idea. I have an idea. Do you guys have wallets? Do you guys have wallets? Maybe you have some form of ID. Do you have a wallet, sir? Sir, do you have a wallet? You do? Go ahead and pull those out quickly for me. Now, don't open them yet. Don't open them yet. You guys are going to like this. Got it, sir? Got it? There you go. These are very special, magical wallets. As soon as you open them up, you're going to see a picture of Britney Spears in there. She's naked, and she's dancing for you. Check it out. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? You know who else is in there naked and dancing? Check it out. Look, Jennifer Lopez. You know what, sir? 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 Hello, hi. <laughs> How you doing? I can put anybody in those wallets naked and dancing you want. Anybody at all. Who would you like to see? Denise Richards. Who's that? She's an actress. She's in Wild Thing. Oh, okay. Check it out. There she is. She's in yours too, sir. How's that? How do you like it? That's great. How about you, sir? <laughs> How about you, sir? Anybody you want to see? Shania. Shania Twain. Good choice. Check it out. There she is. I'll tell, you, <laughs> I'll tell you what, you guys. I got a very special one for you. Very special. You guys ready? Naked and dancing just in your wallet. One, two, three. Check it out. Look. Danny DeVito. That was mean, huh? You guys can go ahead. Go ahead and put those back in your pockets. Go ahead. And I'm kind of upset that you didn't want to see me dancing in your wallet. Would you like to see? You want to see Deborah? Yeah, there she goes. One, two, three. Look, check it out. There she is. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? <laughs> How does she look? You look good. I look good. You look good. <laughs> what do you think? That was outstanding. Oh, she looks good. Maybe she could dance for us and see if it's really her. Oh! oh there I put you. my head on Halle Berry's body. That's what happened. <laughs> All right. You guys, go ahead and put those back in your pockets. I don't see any ID in there, to be quite honest with the two of you. That really sucks for you guys. There you go. Go ahead and put it back in. And sleep. And sleep. Too. Woo. Wow. He sleeps. He sleeps. I hope he doesn't drool on anybody. <laughs> You know, I'm touching upon awakening from this moment on. Any time throughout the evening that I say the word fiddle, you are now the one and only Mr. Charlie Daniels. Now, Charlie, you will not disappoint your fans. Every single time that I say the word fiddle, you will very enthusiastically jump out of your seat. You're going to dance around the stage playing the best air fiddle you've ever played in your entire life. From this moment on, every time I say the word fiddle, you are the one and only Mr. Charlie Daniels. All right, and Susie, you, before you wake them yes. up, we're going to go to break. When we come back, we want to see what they do when it says fiddle. Okay. All right? All right. We'll be right back right after this before sleep. She's a hypnotist who conducts shows throughout the, uh, every night here at the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo. And before we went to break, the key word was fiddle. And Susie, what's supposed to happen when these guys come to and hear the word fiddle? On the commercial break, I told this guy that anytime I say the word fiddle, he is now the lead dancer of the Irish Troop, the River Dance. One, two, three. Wide awake. Wide awake. Hi, guys. Got to throw it off. Excuse me, guys. I got to fiddle with my shoe here for a second. Come on. Get your hands together. Wide awake. Can I help you guys? Everything okay? Have a seat. Give it up for him, ladies and gentlemen. Let me do something with everybody up here. Do something with everybody quickly. Sleep, 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 sleep. <laughs> everyone on stage, everyone on stage, upon awakening. Ooh, there you are. You okay, sir? That's okay. Couldn't have a seat. You I'm touching. One, two, three. Wide awake quickly, ma'am. Sit up. There you go. Get your hat on there. Here you go. Boy. 
sleeping. You're stuck to your seat. There you go, sir. Deep asleep. Everyone on stage, upon awakening, I made you some very, very, very good cookies. Now, you guys love cookies more than anything in the whole wide world. However, there's just one problem. These cookies are the worst things you've ever had in your mouth in your entire life. I'm talking there is something that came from the litter box, but you guys are very polite here in Texas. So every time I ask you how they taste, they're going to tell me that they're absolutely wonderful. These are now the worst tasting cookies you've ever had in your entire life. Everyone on stage one, two, three, wide awake. Hi, you guys. Now, I made you guys some cookies. Go ahead and try them. Quick, there you go. Now, I made these myself. This is a very special recipe. Yeah, just go ahead and take a big, huge bite of those. There you go. There you go. Have this. Now, I made this with a little bit of water, a little bit of sugar. What do you think, ma'am? Mm, mm, uh. They're good? Yeah. Well, thank you. I'm glad you like them. Go ahead and just take yourself one. There you go. Now, I made these myself just a little. Oh, she really likes cookies. There you go. Just, there you go. What do you think, ma'am? Do you like them? Here you go. Here you go. Go ahead and have some. Go ahead and taste them. How are they, sir? You like them? Did you make these? Yes, I did. I actually made them myself. Aren't they great? <laughs> They're delicious. Oh, good. You like them here? Have another one. Go ahead, have another one. There you go. Now, I made these myself. Go ahead, eat it. Go ahead. I'm so glad that you like these cookies because I made them all night. You already ate that one? You must really like them. Go ahead and eat that one. Now, I spent all night long making these, you guys. I am so glad that they like them. You already ate that one? Have another one. Go ahead. And you know what? Since you like them so well, I'm going to watch you eat this one. Mmm, go ahead. No, go ahead, sir. Since you, It gets me such pleasure. Go ahead. I'm going to watch you eat it. There you go. Susie? How is it? Susie, someone dropped some of theirs. I think they oh, want some more. Yeah, they actually so you want dropped more? theirs. There you go. I'm so glad you like these. There you go. Go ahead and just take a big... No, no, no. You can have them. I'm so, I'm so excited that they like these so much. Everyone look at me. Everyone look at me. Bad taste. All gone. Bad taste. All gone. Everyone look at me. Now they're tossing their cookies. <laughs> Everyone look at me. Bad taste. All gone. There you go. I'm going to do one with the guys here. Sleep. Sleep. Sleep in. Sleep, cowboy. Give it up for my stars, ladies and gentlemen. You gentlemen upon awakening, you gentlemen upon awakening, I am the one and only Miss Britney Spears and you are my dancers. That's right, you guys, as soon as you hear the music, you're going to very enthusiastically get out of your seat. You're going to form a line that goes across the stage. You guys are going to follow and copy every single dance move that I make and you're going to follow every instruction that I give you. I'm now the one and only Miss Britney Spears and you are my dancers. One, two, three. Wide awake, wide awake. Please, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for my dancers. Come on up here, guys. Come on. Baby. I'm gonna sing this live for you guys. Oh baby, baby, I was a surprised to know. As a mother, I was a baby, I shouldn't have loved you. Can I help you? Get 
your clothes on right now. What are you guys doing? Susie, I don't know if he can help you, but he can help me.